today we are talking about food preservation. This segment will cover food preservation, freezing vegetables. Freezing is one of the most easiest, most convenient, and least time consuming methods of preserving foods. What we've assembled here today are the tools that you will need to be able to successfully freeze foods for your family and do it in a way that is nutritionally safe and also follows the food safety practices that are important. What we have here is um, assembled a deep pot with a lid which now has boiling water in it, a steamer basket that you will need to be able to blanch your vegetables, an ice, a container with ice water so that you can cool your vegetables and your produce. I have cleaned and prepared these green beans that I'm going to blanch in the um, hot water in just a few minutes. We've cut them into small pieces and a small amount that we will be processing. Blanching is a process that is used it's putting the vegetables into boiling hot water or steam for a short amount of time. And it's used to stop the enzy enzymatic process of the, of the fruit or the vegetable. So what we have done here is then prepared these ready to go. I'm going to measure them out so that I will know exactly how many I'm going to be processing at this time. And you can do this for your family. Put them in the portions that you would use at, at, any, given, at any given meal. So for this time, I'm going to process approximately two cups of beans, putting them into the steamer basket. We will need to set a timer to process these beans. And for this amount, I will use the th three minutes <clears throat> in the boiling water. So submerging, in, submerging them in the water, I will wait a minute for them to come back to a boil. It should take approximately a minute. And once they have boiled, then we will cover them <coughs> and process them for three minutes. So our beans have blanched now for the three minutes that are required. We'll take them out of the boiling water. We want to make sure that we drain them very, very well. Moisture will destroy the product that we are going to freeze if it is not dry as it goes into the freezer bags or, pro or containers. Then we are going to submerge it into a container of ice water. And this will stop the process of cooking. We, don't, we do not want these beans to cook any further. We want them to stop so that we can prepare them to be frozen. Once I am assured that the beans are now cool, I will put them, in, I'm going to use a freezer bag. I will drain them very well to make sure there's no water remaining on them. And then we will put them into the freezer bag. You want to make sure that you work all the air out of the bag and then, and then seal it so that it will be protected. Write the date that you have prepared it. And this concludes our segment on freezing vegetables. <laughs>